I'm Dr. Charles Taylor. I'm director of the School of the Arts at the University of New Orleans. I also serve as chair of the music department. And it's in that role as chair of the music department that I have uh, an affiliation with the Jazz at the Sandbar program. Uh, the Jazz at the Sandbar series is a, is a tremendous asset for our program. The Jazz at the Sandbar series was started before my tenure here at the university by the great jazz pianist Ellis Marcellus when he was the Coca-Cola chair of uh, jazz studies. And it's a great experience for our student musicians. At the same time, the other jazz faculty members took part, Charles Blanc, uh, Harold Batiste, Ed Peterson, Steve Mazakowski, all played instrumental roles in the beginnings of the program. Today, uh, Steve Mazakowski is the Coca-Cola Endowed Chair of Jazz Studies. He is the, the lead faculty member for Jazz at the Sandbar. The biggest help of all is the fact that we have a person who curates the entire event, and that is Jason Patterson. Jason is the one that contracts with the musicians and makes sure everything works smoothly on Wednesday nights each week. And Jason is also the um, contracts the talent for Snug Harbor Jazz Club as well, and so Jason is our primary person responsible for the success of Jazz at the Sandbar. The Jazz at the Sandbar series is of great benefit to the the music students, the jazz studies majors. Um, each week, our, some of our students who are in combos that were selected based on audition at the beginning of each semester have the opportunity to perform with leading jazz artists, both locally and nationally. The guest artists come in and rehearse with the students, um, interact with the students, most of them also do master classes while they're here so that our students can gain the benefit of their knowledge and experience. And then of course on Wednesday nights the guest artists perform with our students. And it's, it's a real world experience that um, other programs can't offer or don't offer. One of our goals for the Jazz at the Sandbar program is to maybe change the percentage and bring in more national artists as opposed to local artists to give our students the opportunity to interact with some of the greatest names in the field. We love to have people come to Jazz at the Sandbar. It's a, it's a public event. It's open to the University of New Orleans campus community, but the entire New Orleans community is invited to come. The Sandbar at the Cove is a restaurant, grill, bar. It's a club setting, but it's, it's a, a very inviting space. Um, 
the public is invited, the campus community is invited. We also would love to have the community, everybody, come to our other University of New Orleans Department of Music events. Um, student recitals, um, student ensemble concerts, guest artist concerts, and we're also home to four really amazing community ensembles. The New Orleans Civic Symphony, the New Orleans Concert Band, the New Orleans Gay Men's Chorus, and the New Orleans Children's Choir all call the university home and give their performances here. So everybody is welcome to attend. Free parking and generally free admission. So everyone is welcome and we look forward to meeting you.